It was a sunny day in 2015, and two boys sat on a curb across the street from their friend's house. The boys had just been told that their friends couldn't come and hang out that day. So there they sat, without any idea of what to do, when one of the boys thought to make a movie. All they had was an iPod touch and an idea. So they spent the rest of the day planning out story and scenes and all sorts of things. The next day, they gathered together the two friends mentioned before and created a film called The Agents. It was my first ever video making experience with my friend Tristan and it inspired me to continue making these movies. At the time, we had no concept of video editing, not even the mobile iMovie app, so we would just play each clip one at a time and enjoy it that way. Fast forward a little, and we were starting to learn more about movie making and editing, and we had loaded the footage into iMovie on Tristan's family computer and minimally edited it. We didn't know how to export video, so we just watched the iMovie file on the computer. Tragically, in a file management accident, all footage from this film was lost. It still floats around in some backup drive somewhere, waiting to be found. But hope, at this point, is almost completely lost. So some things later on will make sense. I will outline the plot of the film for you. Jeff, Bill, and Bryce are discreetly given summons to the secret, secret service base. They meet because a bad guy named Julian Castleberg, who wears a football helmet at all times, is doing bad guy things, and they go out to stop him. They promptly get caught and imprisoned with a bomb. They defuse said bomb and rewire it to explode the whole base. Somewhere within all this, Bryce is injured badly, and they rush him back to home base to save him. He survives, and the story ends with a cliffhanger showing the villain still alive. At some point between late 2015 and early 2016, we decided to watch the J.J. Abrams film Super 8, and we were convinced that we wanted to make an adventure film similar to it and other films in that same vein. For some reason, we decided to make a prequel story to The Agents, about when the main characters were kids and why they wanted to become secret agents. And for some reason, all the characters went to the same school as kids. I'll be back. 
Okay. See ya. Okay, class. Today we're going to go around the circle and say what our dream job is. Okay. Start with you, Walter. I want to be a policeman. I want to be a teacher, just like you, Mr. Robinson. Thank you. That is very touching. <laughs> I want to be a football star. I want to be an, a prisoner. I want to be a boxer. <sighs> Honey, put the bat down. I want to either be a rock star or an accountant. I want to be a government agent. Hmm. Probably a government agent. Um. I have to say I want to be a government agent. Oh, there you go, hey. So we're ready to come for the art show? Yeah. If you ever want an award, you always have to wear nice clothes. Okay, let's go. Hello, people. Welcome to the art show. Today, the winner will be awarded this glass motorcycle. So, try your best. Hi, Dad. Hi, son. And the first person to show their art is Luke Sanders. And this is my didgeridoo. Very cool, very Australian. I will put in a level of what I think that it should be ranked. What's your art? Oh, yeah. Ah, oh, um, that's nice. Um, well, just remember, folks, it has to be three by three by three inches. Didn't you have a different jacket? No questions. So, what did you bring today? Um, or I could a red guitar. Oh, that's really good. Um, yep. Nice. Cool. That's off. Brilliant, I have to say. Probably one of the best so far. Yep, really? Yeah. I brought in a uh, globe. That's a garden. It's a uh, very interesting. It's a concept I made myself. And uh, I plan on making a real version of it when I grow up. That it, yeah. Cool. Next. Hey, go, go. Hey, Bill. So, what did you bring in today? Um, a car. Made out of pure wood. Painted it myself. You could use better paint. It's not going to run that fast. But still, I'll give you a grade. Okay, I think. Next. 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 And finally, next. Uh, so, um, can Bill from your six come up? Where are you, Bill? Yes. There you go. Thanks. Ciao. The fair is over. This film was never completed because a few of the people working on it lost interest. At home, I made a trailer for this film using all new footage, and I made a trailer for the original film with recreated footage. Here are both of those.
So, would you like your cow? Yes, please. Everybody says that. The Perplex is 320. Yeah, it's a bomb. I'm trying to solve it. You're not going to survive at all. Let me try. Ding. I guess at around that time we created what is now Crazy Kids Studios. Uh, but I realized that some of the videos I wanted to make were more, I guess, YouTube-y than his. I was more into parodies and vlogs and talking into a camera, and I wanted to post stuff on YouTube. And at the time, he didn't. So I made the YouTube channel as it is today. But I digress. Right now, those videos are all that exists of the agents. But not for long. In late 2017, we started a bigger, better beast of a home video that was the agent's top secret, which chronicled their first official secret secret service mission. At some point over the next few months, I'll publish this movie, and when I do, make sure to cook up some popcorn and buckle up, because it's going to be a roller coaster of emotions, ranging from groans to uh, quiet sort of chuckles. As a sort of somber footnote, in December of 2018, my movie making buddy Tristan moved away. And since then, movie what? making hasn't been quite as enticing. So these more cinematic videos will most likely be few and far between once I upload the backlog of already shot movies.